Hey everyone, in this video we'll learn about 7 segment displays. So 7 segment displays, they consist of 7 LEDs, called segments, and are arranged in the shape of an 8 as we can see here. And then most 7 segment displays actually have 8 segments, with a dot on the right side of the digit that acts as a decimal point. So here is our number 8, or our 7 segment display. Each of the lines or segments, they actually have their own corresponding letters, and they go in a clockwise direction. So for example, if we have a look at the mouse, it's A, B, C, D, E, F, and then G in the middle, and here is our decimal point. And each of the letters, they have their own pins. So for example, A here, it will be this green wire, which is pin number 7. And then let's say A, B, C. So for example, C here. C will be this wire, which is pin number four. So now let's have a look at the code. So we will firstly assign each of the letters to their pin number. So A would be seven, B would be six, C would be four. Then onwards. Then we have setup. So we initialize the digital pins as outputs. So pin A, output, pin B, output, and then onwards. Then inside the void loop, so I've gave it a go for zero to number five. But of course we can have as many numbers as we want and as many letters as we want. But I'll go through the number zero as an example. So remember how each of the segments or lines, they actually have their own corresponding pins. So if we trigger these pins, the LEDs will light up at that spot. So, for example, if we picture it, the number zero, it would just be the borders of the number eight, right? So we have pin A will be high, pin B will be high, pin C will be high, pin D will be high, pin E will be high, pin F will be high, and then pin G and pin B will be low, and then delay by 500. So if we follow this process, we can do it with the same other numbers. So let's have a look at the simulation. So this should display from 0 to 5. 